here in the i button and in description box below will get complete play playlist of this chapter welcome to video number 12 and in this video we are going to uh, proof we are going to prove first and second recurrence formula okay so let us start with the first recurrence formula before starting this video i would request to subscribe to my channel and please like this video and uh, please share the playlist of this chapter with your friends okay yes please support me yes first recurrence formula that is d upon dx of x to the power n into j n x that is equals to x to the power n into j n minus 1 times okay yes x to the power n j n minus 1 x fine let us prove since from here you can see first we will see what is j n x then we will multiply x to the power n with this then we will differentiate with respect to x and then we will see whether we can achieve this formula or not okay yes since we know that j n x equals to summation r equal to 0 to infinity minus 1 power r x upon 2 power n plus 2 r into 1 upon factorial r into gamma of n plus r plus 1 okay yes now we will multiply x to the power n with this okay that is x to the power n into j n x equals to summation r equal to 0 to infinity minus 1 power r okay if you see here power of x is what n plus 2 r if you multiply x to the power n here you will get x to the power 2 n plus 2 r okay upon power of 2 is what 2 sorry n plus 2 r so 2 to the power n plus 2 r this part is as it is okay this part is as it is fine now we will differentiate okay we have j n x then we have multiplied x to the power n with j n x now we are going to differentiate with respect to x so differentiating both sides with respect to x then let's see what we get yes d upon dx of x to the power n, n into j n x equals to summation r equal to 0 to infinity minus 1 power r yes here we have x to the power 2 n plus 2 r if you take common 2 you will get 2 into n plus r and this will become x to the power 2 n plus 2 r minus 1 after differentiating this part with respect to x you will get 2 into n plus r into x to the power 2 n plus 2 r minus 1 okay this is as it is that is 2 to the power n plus 2 r and this part is also as it is that is gamma sorry factorial r into gamma of n plus r plus 1 fine let's go ahead okay yes <coughs> sorry summation r equal to 0 to infinity this is as it is that is minus 1 power r okay here we have 2 so taking this 2 in the denominator we will get 2 to the power n plus 2 r minus 1 okay if you take 2 in the denominator part you will get 2 to the power minus 1 so this is going to be 2 to the power n plus 2 r minus 1 okay yes now n plus r is as it is we are taking yes we are, are taking x plus sorry x to the power n okay common from this so if you take x to the power n from this you will get x to the power n plus 2 r minus 1 okay because this into this will give you this part now this is this is factorial r and this is gamma of n plus r plus 1 okay here we need to use one form formula that is gamma of n plus 1 can be written as n times gamma of n okay let's suppose this is what this is my n so this is gamma of n plus 1 which can be written as n into gamma of n okay yes here we can cancel out that is n plus r okay yes go ahead yes we can take this part okay outside of this uh, summation that is x to the power n and in the proof also we need to prove this that is x to the power n into this that is j n x j n minus 1 x fine okay x to the power n is written outside of the summation because it doesn't contain r fine okay x to the power n into uh, summation r equal to 0 to infinity minus 1 power r okay we have taken this outside of this uh, summation don't look at this part okay now come to this this is x to the power n plus 2 r minus 1 this is again 2 to the power n plus 2 r minus 1 so we can say x upon 2 power yes we can write this as n minus 1 plus 2 r n minus 1 plus 2 r okay yes now again you see 1 upon this is factorial r into since we have written here n minus 1 so we need to write this in this form that is n should be written as in n minus 1 form so gamma of n minus 1 plus r plus 1 okay yes 
if you remove this bracket you can see minus 1 plus 1 will get cancelled so you will get again gamma of n plus r okay so there is no change in this okay yes now yes x to the power n into if you solve if you see this part this is what this is this is my j n minus 1 x okay if you see this in place of n we need to write n minus 1 so this is going to be j n minus 1 x so hence proved hence we can say like we have proved first recurrence formula which is this part okay now let us solve let us prove second recurrence formula second recurrence formula says d upon dx of x to the power minus n into j n x equals to minus of x to the power minus n into j n plus 1 x let us try to prove since okay okay uh, what should be my approach to uh, to get uh, to prove this first we see what is j n x then we will multiply this with this then we will differentiate whole okay yes since we have j n x equals to summation r equal to 0 to infinity minus 1 power n x upon 2 power n plus 2 r into 1 upon factorial r into gamma of n plus r plus 1 we have already seen this formula while uh, proving first recurrence formula okay yes now we'll, we will multiply x to the power n minus to n on both the sides okay this will become minus x to the power minus n into j n x equals to yes if you see power of x is what n plus 2 r if you multiply x to the power minus n here then plus n and minus n will get cancelled so you will be left with x to the power 2 r okay and this will be same that is summation r equal to 0 to infinity minus 1 power r this x will become x to the power 2 r denominator uh, part will be isolated that is 2 to the power n plus 2 r okay yes n plus 2 r and this is as it is that is 1 upon factorial r into gamma of n plus r plus 1 now we will differentiate both sides with respect to x okay we will differentiate both side with respect to x so this is going to be d upon dx of x to the power minus n into j n x equals to yes if you closely observe then here we have x that is x to the power 2 1 so rest will be as it is that is summation r equal to 0 to infinity minus 1 power r yes if you want to solve this part then this uh, differentiation of x to the power 2 r will become 2r into x to the power 2r minus 1. Differentiation of x to the power 2r will become 2r into x to the power 2r minus 1. This is as it is and this this part is also as it is. Fine. Okay. Now, simply go ahead. Yes. If you see, yes. Here, summation r equal to 0 to infinity. Here we have minus 1 power r. Yes. Take this 2 to the new uh, denominator uh, part. You will get 2 to the, two to the power n plus 2 r minus 1 okay this r is as it is x to the power 2 r minus 1 this is also as it is now here 1 upon this is what this is uh, factorial r and since we know that factorial n can be written as n times factorial n minus 1 so we can rewrite this factorial r as r into factorial r minus 1 and this part is as it is that is gamma of n plus r plus 1 okay in this way we can cancel r and r okay yes now okay summation r equal to 0 to infinity minus 1 power r here we need to okay in the formula if you see yes in the second recurrence formula we have x to the power minus n so we need to multiply x to the power minus n with x to the power n so that both will get cancelled and we will be left with one only okay yes so x to the power minus n into x to the power n into this part is as it is that is x to the power 2 r minus 1 this part is also as it is and this part is also as it is that is 1 upon uh, factorial r minus 1 into gamma of n, n plus r plus 1 okay now we'll take this outside of this summation that is x to the power minus n into summation of r equal to 0 to infinity this is minus 1 power r and if you multiply x to the power n with this you will get x to the power n plus 2 r minus 1 okay in the denominator part we have 2 to the power n plus 2 r minus 1 and this part is as it is fine okay now again proceed yes we have x to the power minus n summation r equal to 0 to infinity we can write minus 1 power r as minus 1 into minus 1 power r minus 1 why we are doing this because here if you see yes factorial this is what this is factorial r minus 1 so we need to make this and this r as r minus 1 so this can be written as 
minus 1 into minus 1 power r minus 1 this is okay this is as it is that is x upon 2 power now since the power is same we can write this as x upon 2 power n plus 2 r minus 1 okay now here this part is as it is fine okay in the next step yes here minus 1 we are taking this minus 1 outside of this summation that is minus of x to the power minus n summation r equal to 0 to infinity yes minus 1 power r minus 1 yes here you can see x upon 2 this can be written as n plus 1 plus 2 times r minus 1 okay yes since we have r minus 1 here so we need to make this r okay 2 r as 2 into r minus 1 okay yes if you simplify this part you will get this okay yes to balance only we we have added this okay that is n plus 1 so if you simplify this you will get this fine and since we have n plus 1 here so this is this n should be also replaced with n plus 1 fine so this is 1 upon gamma of so this is 1 upon factorial r minus 1 here that is gamma of n plus r plus 1 can be written as n plus 1 plus r minus 1 plus 1 1 1 will get cancelled we will be left with this part okay if you simplify this part we will get this fine okay now you can see n is replaced with n plus 1 fine okay so we can say finally that is this can be written as minus x to the power minus n into j n plus 1 x okay and this is what this is what we wanted to prove that is second recurrence formula okay i hope that you have learned a lot from this video if this is the case then please hit the like button and do share the playlist of this chapter with your friends okay thank you thank you so much